Here we go. On the left hand side is a diagram showing the enumeration of one phrase called P through a bunch of iterations ending up with 80. On the right hand side is the actual original phrases. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of composing in Vision and Sound Part 33 song, Stages, Bootstrap, Intuit, Positioning. In today's episode, we re-entered by reflecting that learning new things and creative stress seem to go together. In particular, this new Raga series we've been working with, generating a new material has become a primary activity contrasted with arranging the material which has now become secondary into a pleasing overall composition. In particular, we took four thematic phrases, the original four, and generated, depending on how you count it, 22 or 80. So what we're going to do is just show you what we've been spending the last several chapters of this episode on. Starting at the top here, P1 is phrase 1. P2 is like that. Well, if we reflect it, which is what we did, if you reflect it through our 13 custom scale 13, 14, and 15 like this, you get a bunch of possible variations, which is what these things are showing. And so we took this conceptual idea and did it in practice. Now, every time you reflect what we call a trough, the reverse reflection is a, I mean, that was an arc, turns into a trough. So that made sense. And then this, this theme, which went, And you can hear how different it sounds already. Well, talk about different. Here's phrase three. It gets reflected to. And then P4. And then we get these wild changes in octaves because of the nature of the scales that we're using. These custom scales all have one of their notes, uh, for example here the D reflects to itself and this one the E flat reflects to itself and over here the F reflects to itself. So we, we had to work out our rules of thumb for all that. Now those were the lines of first reflections. Now if you go through the second reflection, so you take this one and reflect it again, well, it's a trough, it's going to turn into an arc. So here's the trough. Becomes an arc again. So when we oh, we've been experimenting with overlay, overlaying these and then finally we reflect it a third time. So if you take again remember you take an arc you're going to get a trough which we can compare with the first reflections. And because it's triple, we get another option. So we've been having a relative uh, creative tension session. The tension was uh, reflecting these scales on the fly using this little these reflection circles. And we compared it to flying by instruments. In a plane, if you can't see because of the weather, you have to trust your instruments and look at the altimeter and the bank indicator and the pitch indicator and and that's part of the key training for pilots that we've read about not that we've trained as a pilot but we've known pilots and read about pilot training so we're flying on instruments 
was a, a, a key theme for this overall chapter. So anyway, we're not going to play all of these for you, but it's kind of interesting to compare how things turn out. Like over here, this theme, uh, when you try to reflect it through this scale, it, it, it turns into itself. So there's these interesting gaps where you don't get any new phrases. But um, over here, it still gives you something new. And some of them sound pretty cool played on top of each other. Let's go with the... Tr uh. Now, just for grins, <laughs> we'll play everything all at once starting here. So that concludes today's episode. <laughs> that really sounds like something we heard on a concert one. So that alone would be a great intro or extra for a video, we think. Um, our ideas for next time are to, um, well, we kind of need to let our brain shake out a little bit, but uh, continue working with it, spot check some of the new triple reflections, cherry pick some phrases to use like we just did there. And we also have a, a virtual reality dance edit project that we're working on. We had to reshoot part of it. We just finished that. And our good old friend, To Be Determined. Shout outs to Lupine Entertainment, who stopped by, Dina Mittig G5, Silent Lurker, Steady Worker, Bootstrapper, and Intuitor. We appreciate you. Tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care. Do come back. And do keep on streaming.